Hello and welcome. When we left off, we discovered the traitor was Royland. It was a pretty stupid thing, really. I mean, he wanted us to fight the White Hills, so he sabotages us. We're almost there, Let's have a look. Oh, great. My soldiers are killing each other. Save your lovemaking for below deck. <laughs> they listen to you. Barely. Yeah, better what than nothing. What happens if your lord brother decides he's the one in charge once we're at Ironrath? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Oh, I doubt it. Or will it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A lord sounds an awful lot like a master. Doesn't matter if Roderick's lord of our house. These are my soldiers to lead. Oh, nice. You may want to start by telling them your brother's not to be harmed. He hasn't had a chance to win them over like you have. Good point. Hmm. Point taken. Well, I think we're making an fall. Hmm. That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. Could be. Or, could be we'll have a fight on our hands. I'll let the others know. Right. Oh, this couldn't be easy, could it? Damn, this place looks... I don't know, I mean, maybe it's just the art style, but the place looks like it was attacked. Like, th the stuff looks burned. Quite badly burned, mind you. So, this is Westeros. Ugly and small. Fucking freezing, too. I said you'd be paid. I never said you'd be warm. Well, it looks like we've somehow gotten more of these people. Oh, good. For a second, I thought the White Hills were already here. Asher. Thank the gods you've made it back. Well, we did it. We got the two together. You've looked better. We've no time for small talk, brother. Hope you're ready for a fight. Lord knows you're coming. He sent men to intercept you. We need to hurry. Well, I mean, if he's coming to us, th this looks like a small keep. We'd, we'd have a Stop bit of an advantage, wouldn't we? Weeks. we can use a good fight. I mean, Whitehill mustn't have that many men. This could probably make a difference. So why are we going out to the field to face him? Wait, who's that? What? Holy shit, I recognize him. He's that one that was pretending to be Ethan. Like, and the other soldiers were pretending to be Boltons, and then they were reenacting his death. Oh crap, we're already here. Oh fuck, White Hill's here. Wait a minute, did, did Roden lie to me? Did he send Griff here? Huh, that was easy. Alright, what well, we need to. Oh, shit, that is brutal. <laughs> and that's pretty badass, that. Alright, we need to get our soldiers in here. Griff only had a small garrison of like 50 men, so we could probably win. Oh! That is brutal. Asha, you have to get out of there! Looks like it's up to us! Damn, it's always that, archers. Asha! I thought crossbows weren't meant to be Where's rare in Game of Thrones. They've got us outnumbered. Oh shit! We have to get out of here. Oh, okay. There's n there's no way we're going to be able to win this here. We've got to retreat. Ah, oh. that's not a lot of soldiers, but it's definitely more than we can handle. Wait, can't we block it with something? One of us has to stay! Ah, oh, crap. Gotta make a choice here. My lord, you must hurry! I choose Roderick. We can't lose you! He can stay behind. Save your life and our house. Ash is the only one who'd be able to lead these cell swords. Iron from ice. Also, I think it's a bit of an appropriate end. I mean, you know, he held down the fort for reinforcements, really. My lord, you can't. Asher is your new lord. 
Yes, my lord. Rodrick, go. Jeez, I hope the what? Uh, Lord Whitehill soldiers aren't coming as well. Oh, here we go. Let's see how many we can take out with us. Alright, that's three. Four. Oh, that's... Uh, okay, yeah, that's still four. Oh, fuck. By the way, I am counting the one that Asher already killed. Alright, I want to kill... Oh! Fuck! I swear, before I die, I want to at least take down that, that bastard. Or if not him, the guy who cut the rope. Oh, come on, give me this at least, Telltale. Let me kill that one guy. Jeez, what is this armor made of? Why is it not doing anything? I, I should never have showed mercy to Griff. And I had the chance, I should have killed him. Or at the very least, mutilated him. Oh, well, let's see our choices. That's not really surprising. I mean, you know, Ramsey was, wasn't going to die. Actually, I, want, I wonder if we would have even been able to injure him, though. I mean, I doubt it, but... Yeah. I guess that's the final act of Roderick really showing mercy to Ramsey. And showing mercy to Roiland. I, I gotta say, for all my mercy and all my planning and everything, it, it, it really didn't count for shit, did it? Huh, I'm surprised not many people killed him. That does not surprise me. I do regret it a little bit, though. Uh, yeah, I can kind of see that. I mean, I needed the information. I, st I, st I still can't believe it was R Royland. Yeah, I stand by my decision. Right there. To well, I mean, I did just make it two minutes ago, so I obviously should. But I don't know, I think it was the right... I mean, like, e everyone always said, like, Asher was really the warrior of the family. And I mean, at this point, we, we you know, we've got the call to war. I think Roderick's given us a good starting point. Now Asher can actually win the war. After all, all I really need to face is Lud's own soldiers. I mean, Mir has already eliminated his uh, mercenaries. Garrett is... Well, he's still looking for the North Grove. I mean... I, I, I don't know what, what's going to happen there. I still don't know why it's supposed to be significant to House Forrester, but... Apparently it is. It's an ice dragon. I mean, I think episode 6 is meant to be called the ice dragon. I mean, that would actually be a pretty awesome way of, like, you know, winning this war. Just bring a, bring a dragon from the north. Uh, to be honest, I, I don't even know what an ice dragon is. I mean, for all I know, it could just be, like, a really badass name for something really shit. You know, despite everything, I am still a bit optimistic. I mean, granted, we, j we did just have a pretty awful ending. But, I mean, look on the bright side. Even if we do lose this war, it's as I said, we've still got Daenerys off in, you know, Essos. I mean, when she inevitably comes towards Westeros, we've got her as an ally. So even if we lose this war and everything, you know, at least the White Hills die as well. Although I do admit, after all this, I am I am really hoping I do get to kill the White Hills personally. Especially Griff. Griff and Lud. Well, actually, no, those are the only two male ones I've seen. 
Alright, that's the end. So, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the series. Please like, rate, and subscribe, and goodbye. Thanks for watching.